Welcome to Healthy Gyan, my dear friends. In today's video, we are having one very interesting question from exponential equations. We'll be solving xth root of 16 minus xth root of 4 plus xth root of 1 over xth root of 8 plus xth root of 2 equal to 2. And we have to find out only real solutions. So let's get started by considering our substitution xth root of 2. This is equal to a. Now I can write all the values of xth root. So let me write xth root of 4. This value will be a square. xth root of 8. This value will be a cube. xth root of 16. This value will be a power 4. And xth root of 1, it will be 1 for all real x. So let us rewrite our equation in terms of a. So I will be writing a power 4 minus a square plus 1 divided by a cube plus a. And RHS is 2. Now we know that b power x, it cannot be 0. So I can cross multiply. I can write a power 4 minus a square plus 1 equal to 2 times a cube plus a. Now I will take all the term to one side. So it will become a power 4 minus a square plus 1 minus 2a cube minus 2a equal to 0. After rearranging, I can write a power 4 minus 2a cube minus a square minus 2a plus 1 equal to 0. Now I can divide this equation by a square as a is non-zero. So let's divide both sides by a square, a square and this side also by a square. So I'll be writing a square minus 2a minus 1 minus 2 over a plus 1 over a square equal to 0. Now I will consider first and last term altogether. So a square plus 1 over a square. Second and second last term after taking minus 2 common a plus 1 over a. And left constant is negative 1 equal to 0. Now I can do one manipulation step. I will add 2. So let me add 2 here. So I need to subtract 2. So I will subtract here. So from these three terms, I can write it as a plus 1 over a whole square. Second term as it is minus 2 times a plus 1 over a and here I will be writing minus 3 equal to 0. Now you can see this equation is quadratic equation in a plus 1 over a. So I will write a straight forward value of a plus 1 over a. Let me write here once a plus 1 over a whole a square minus 2 times a plus 1 over a minus 3 times equal to 0. Now, I will write here quadratic formula for a plus 1 over a value minus b. So, 2 plus minus under the root b square. So, minus 2 square minus 4ac, 4 times 1 times c is negative 3, divided by 2a, a is 1, as per formula. So now I can write 2 plus minus the square root, 4 plus 12, divided by 2. Further I can write 2 plus minus root 16, 
divided by 2 or I can write 2 plus minus 4 over 2. So with plus sign I will be having 6 over 2. So I will write 6 over 2 with minus sign I will write minus 2 over 2 which is 3 and negative 1. So I will consider a plus 1 over a 1 by 1 3 and negative 1. So a plus 1 over a equal to 3 and a plus 1 over a equal to negative 1. Let's solve both the reciprocal equation. I will write first equation after multiplying both sides by a. a square plus 1 equal to 3a. a is non-zero. a cannot be zero. Now a square minus 3a plus 1 equal to zero. Let's apply quadratic formula. Minus b. So 3 plus minus under the root b square. So 9 minus 4ac. So minus 4 divided by 2a. So 2. So I can write a is equal to 3 plus minus square root 5 divided by 2 real values of a. Now a plus 1 over a equal to minus 1 equation. I will multiply again with a both sides as a is non-zero. So a square plus 1 equal to minus a. a square plus a plus 1 equal to 0. Now I will write only discriminant value. It will be equal to b square. So b square is 1 square minus 4 times 1 times 1. So 1 minus 4 which is coming out negative 3. As discriminant is negative, we can write complex solutions will generate so we can easily reject this equation for our real solution calculation. So I will write reject it. Now which solution we are going to accept? It is 3 plus minus root 5 over 2. Let us write 3 plus minus root 5 over 2. Now we know that root 5 is 2.236 this value. So both the values will be positive. Now let us put back our substitution. It was xth root of 2 equal to 3 plus minus root 5 over 2. Or I can write 2 power 1 over x equal to 3 plus minus root 5 over 2. Now I will consider log both sides. So let me write log and this side also log. Now we know the property of log. Log a power b. This b will come as a multiplier. It will become b log a. So I can write our equation as 1 over x log 2 obviously with base 10 equal to log 3 plus minus root 5 divided by 2. Now I will take x value. So I will write x is equal to log 2 base 10 over log 3 plus minus root 5 over 2. So I will write x is equal to log 2 over log 3 plus minus root 5 over 2. Now again I will write one property of log. It is log a over log b. We can write any time log a with base b. So I can write my answer x will be equal to log 2 
with base 3 plus minus root 5 over 2. There are two, two solutions, two values of x log 2 with base 3 plus root 5 over 2 and second solution is log 2 with base 3 minus root 5 over 2 and this is our final solution. I hope friends you will like this video. Thank you so much for watching. Do not forget to like, share and subscribe. Bye bye till next video. Good luck. Take care of yourself. Bye bye.